I found a Prothean Sphere on Gay Hinnom. Contact the Alliance and tell them Commander Shepard asked them to pay you for it. Yes, thank you. I'll call them right now. You do not understand. I recovered the Code of the Ancients from Dakuna. It's waiting for you in Bay D24. With shock and joy. Really, this is wonderful news. Thank you, human. Sincerely. This will greatly aid our people. There's got to be something. I, don't... I came across this treatment plant at a chemical plant. Could it help? Treatment? What is... I've never seen this kind of process before. Huh. Probably experimental. It's a long shot, but let's run some tests and see if it might work for our patient. I pulled this from a Geth jamming tower. Maybe you can use it. How the hell did you... Well, never mind. A tech like this? I don't care where it came from. I'll have my people run with this. If the war comes back here, maybe we can save more lives. Damn it. If we kept digging... I've recovered the obelisk of Karza. It's waiting for you in Bay D-24. You have? It's amazing! Thank you, Commander. That's going to help immeasurably with some very sensitive work. <laughs> These are control schematics for Cerberus turrets. Will these help? Damn right they will. I'll have E-Crimes dig into them. Might even help us find the little present Cerberus left for us. Thanks a lot. This is gonna save lives. I couldn't help but overhear your conversation. Maybe these heating stabilizer schematics could help? This is amazing. The colonists, my sister, will be most pleased. Thank you. I am in your debt. Excuse me, I'm Commander Shepard. If you promise to be careful, I've got something for you. A Reaper code fragment? Yes, I can use this to try to predict their strategic processes. We might be able to save a few worlds with this, Commander. Thank you. You're Intel, right? I found these encryption codes on a Cerberus engineer. I thought they might be helpful. Cerberus ciphers? That's exactly what we've been looking for. Thank you, Commander. Was the Volus Ambassador here earlier? Yes, he was, Commander. I need in. Spectre business. I'll unlock the office when you're ready. Before. 
Has that changed? How many colonies would be gone if we hadn't taken action against the Collectors? Too many. But fighting the Alliance... Must continue in order to end the war. We understand it took a lot for you to reach out to Cerberus, Ambassador Korlak. We ask that you trust us a little longer. You people are monsters! Ambassador, please. Hundreds dead. Udina betraying the Council. I should have cut ties with you ages ago. And what will that accomplish now? The risks you took by passing information to Cerberus. It's left you in an interesting position. If you sever contact, we can't protect you from the consequences. I don't... I have no time for this. We'll speak again. Have a good day, Ambassador Korlak. The Turians think I'm still working for Cerberus. They've put a price on my head. I can't go to CSEC, but Cerberus has plans. An entire Turian colony rests on my life. If anyone finds this, I hid a tracking receiver in the office suite beside the human embassies. This is Commander Shepard. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, I can hear you. Tell me where you are. Uh, we're still near the Presidium. CSEC will check Selkish arms when they realize I'm missing. They won't give a damn when they realize you sold them out to Cerberus. Wait. Cerberus is planning to attack a colony that... Stay calm. Help's coming. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. Zaid used to work for Cerberus. Ask him why he's here. Why? Why go after your old employer, Zaid? How you know my name all of a sudden? Good question. door. He needs you alive to stop Cerberus. Cerberus is after a Turian colony. Kill me, and they get it. Shepard's investigating. He's a recent acquaintance. How recent? Very. Shit. All right, I'm listening. Been a while, Zaid. Shepard. Glad I wasn't just making an ass of myself over a hunch. Undisciplined bastards. This is what I get for signing up at the last minute. Where's Korlak? 
I'm here, Commander. I... You saved my life. I almost died because the Turians thought I was still with Cerberus. Did those mercs hurt you? I'm fine. They wanted me alive until the fees were delivered for my capture. They didn't care about what I had to say. You kept mentioning a colony in your message. Information on a Turian planet's defense system. They'll strike soon. But if I tell you which planet they're attacking, Cerberus will know I turned traitor. Turn? You already betrayed your own people. We saved your life. Tell us what planet you put in danger. I can offer a bargain. The Volus bombing fleet. In tactical terms, it's worth far more than a colony. Or you could give us both. You can warn the Turians there'll be an attack, Commander. That should be general enough to ward off suspicion. You tried to do the right thing before. It failed because you trusted the wrong people. Now here's your chance to make up for it. You're giving us Vola support, and you're going to help us make Cerberus pay for using you. I can't. You can. Waste of everyone's time trying to appeal to a Volus's better nature, Shepard. Aphis. The colony's name is Aphis. Cerberus wants its shipyards. And the bombing fleet? Yes, it's yours, Commander. I'll speak with Citadel Security about this... incident. You have my thanks. Took him long enough to spit that out. Zaid, what are you doing here? Later. C6 on their way. Won't be too pleased with the mess we left them. Catch up with me at the docks if you like. sent me a message about this apartment? I want you to have it. Take it off my hands. Are you serious? You need a place that's yours. Somewhere to recharge. Clear your head. Kaylee wanted us to settle down there. Thing is, the longer I'm on Earth, the less I want to leave. And I want as few loose ends out there as possible. Like I said, you'd be doing me a favor. It's too generous. Besides, you'll be back here once the war's over. I doubt it. Even assuming we survive this, it'll take years to rebuild things here. Please, Commander. Don't make me beg. All right. Consider it done. I appreciate it. And make yourself at home, dammit. It's yours now. I'm sure I can manage. Okay, good. Been meaning to do that for a while. I'll talk to you soon. Be careful out there, Anderson. You too, Shepard.
Ah, Commander Shepard, your table is red. Shepard, not bad, huh? The sushi place is serious, like French guy at the door serious. Only had to save the galaxy twice to get a table here. You see the line outside? But here I am, drink in hand. Best pilot in the universe and a rock star. <laughs> Any news from the Normandy? Oh, uh, you know, maintenance stuff. It's hard knowing a bunch of strangers are poking around at my ship. I, I mean, your ship. Let someone else do the work for once. Hackett's orders. You're on shore leave. Yeah, whether we like it or not. I'm sure you'll manage. I may need a drink that comes with an umbrella. I'm the first human specter. I'll get you two umbrellas. Awesome use of power, boss. So, your email said it was important? My email? I'm here because I got a message from you. The hell? I, I didn't send anything. Commander! Excuse me. Sorry. Nine's business. Commander, this is urgent! I don't think that's the umbrella lady. Commander Shepard, I'm Staff Analyst Maya Brooks. Alliance. Excuse me. Alliance Intelligence. There are people trying to kill you. Yeah, I think he's aware of that. No, I don't mean Starburst and the Reapers. I mean other people. New people. They're... it's... <sighs> Someone is hacking your account. Comm channels, personal records. They're targeting you specifically. Targeting me? What do they want? The intel isn't definitive yet. Last time, I guess, without definitive intel, we almost landed troops on a gas giant. Which is bad. Hang on, Brooks. Take a breath. <sighs> From the top, what do you know? Excuse me, you don't have a reservation. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight's performance is brought to you by Random Acts of Violence. Stay there. I'm coming. Joker? Ow, my pancreas. Hey! Damn it. Got one, sir! Find the crew. I'm going after her. Find the crew. Got it. Stay down. Stay down. 
Yep. Feeling good. Brooks, you got hit. I know! I used Medigel. A lot of it. Um, all of it, actually. I know, everything is a little bit bouncy. I think you used too much. So, can I help with anything? Alert CSEC. I'll look for a way out. Brooks. I see some sky cars across the gap. Maybe a landing pad. I'm checking the area. Transportation, no. Food, no. Laundry. Ah! Oh, it's a sky car lot. Scission Motors. Get a shuttle over there. I'll find a way across. Okay. Right. So, um, it turns out CSEC has the whole area locked down. It's gonna be a tiny bit tricky to get you a shuttle. Keep at it, Brooks. Also, stay off your calm. Well, except for me. It's hacked. That's probably how they found you. Who are these guys? I don't know. But they really don't seem to like you. Yeah, I'm sensing that. Hey. Need a little backup. He scared me there. I'm on foot, but not far. Excuse me, who is this? You're on an unsecured channel, and you're putting Commander Shepard in danger. What? Who is this? Hang on. Joker mentioned staff analyst Brooks, yes? That's her. Everybody play nice. Good to hear. Things are a little dicey. Wouldn't have it any other way.
Brooks, found a way across. It's locked down. Right, because of the, uh, lockdown. Uh, can you get through? I'll try to override. It's all under control. Is that some kind of alarm? What's going on? Thought I'd make things more interesting. Of course you did. Good. What do we know about the bad guys? They have guns and don't like me. They called me. Understood. Okay. Brooks over. No, out. B uh, Brooks out. Oh, over and out. Brooks. Oh, damn it. Having a bad day, Shepard? You could say that. <laughs> Landing pad is just over there, but it's behind a locked gate. Let's look for a control panel. Nice outfit. Control panel, right. Heard you fell through a fish tank. We'll talk about it later. It's kind of a shame. Great sushi there. We'll talk about it later.
Stand back. Hang on. Hey, can you open the gate? Thanks. Please leave. Well, I could have done that. Rex, what are you doing here? Ah, uh, just butting heads with the council over Krogan expansion. Shepard, we got a way out of here. Rex, I'm a professional. That's not a yes. It's not a no. Joker, we lost our ride. Where are you? On my way. Picked up Brooks. Figured you'd have a few questions. Good call. Good to be back. Yeah! Commander, did C-Sec find you? Are you okay? Yes and no. Merc's in a C-Sec shuttle. What? A little busy right now. Right, sorry. We'll be there soon. Someone want to tell me what's going on here? Yeah, who were those guys? They were heavily armed and using C-Sec shuttles. I don't know. I've never seen them before. I can't believe you survived all that. They had guns and grenades and those drone things. It's all right. I'm calling Commander Bailey. See what's going on with C-Sec. Okay, that sounds... Wait! Wouldn't that just make whoever you contact a target too? She's right, Shepard. Until we know more, it's a big risk. Okay. For now, we run this ourselves. Right. Ourselves. On our own. Outside the law. Okay. Yeah. Brooks, it's okay. I know this is a lot to deal with. I got shot. I got medigel, but still, I took a desk job explicitly to not get shot. And you killed a hundred guys with a pistol! Well, yes. That did happen. I mean, who does that? Well, you, I guess. But besides you. They said the medigel might make me jumpy. Do I seem jumpy? How did you get mixed up in this? I monitored data for Alliance Intel to prevent fraud and hacking of officer IDs. Like, uh, someone using an Admiral's pass to get into a nightclub on the Citadel when that Admiral is fighting on Tuchanka. I wrote a tracking program, 
It's really neat. I named it Mr. Biscuits, after my cat. Brooks. Right, sorry. Anyway, Mr. Bis- uh, My program detected a breach in your classified files. Soon, everything we had on you was compromised. Personnel files, mission reports, everything. Since when does hacking personnel records involve heavy weapon fire? Think of what criminals could do if they had Shepard's military access codes. Or Spectre codes, even. Explains why they need you dead, Shepard. Nothing to stop them till the damage is done. Okay. Let's figure out who they are and shut them down. Ideas? Maybe. That pistol you picked up. For such a tiny thing, it packs a punch. Never seen anything like it before. Let me see it. I might be able to help. Glyph. I'll begin collating relevant intel for review, Dr. Tassoni. Liara? Shepard, I'm relieved to see you're in one piece. A shame about the sushi place, though. It was a favorite. I hear that. All right, the hour's on point. What about the rest of the crew? Yeah, what about those slackers? Joker, you've been busy. I found some folks who actually like being shot at. Permission to come aboard, Shepard. Okay, later, when this is over and everything is settled, we are gonna talk about this bait thing. What's up, Commander? Back during my pilgrimage, I used to walk around near that sushi place and watch the fish through the window. I knew they'd never let me inside, but I think to myself, someday, when I've proven my worth to the galaxy, I'll go there for dinner. And then, you broke their floor. Do they even have food you can eat there? Not the point, Shepard. Glad Liara's on this. If anybody can sift through a mountain of boring stuff to find that one critical clue, it's her. The restaurant attack has made the news. Civilian casualties seem to have been restricted to... fish. Nothing beats having a Krogan bodyguard, huh? Had a buddy like that once. Uh, no, not so much a buddy, really. More of a prisoner who helped us. <laughs> it's a long story, man. Anyway... Brooke, she's kinda cute. Think she's on the market? Commander, in my cycle, when we fled combat by falling through tanks containing aquatic animals, we usually... Oh, right. We never did. <laughs> you are a trailblazer. Bet you never saw a shuttle get taken down like that before. <laughs> I still got it. So, what was it, Shepard, five minutes before someone started shooting at you? On the other hand, we get this cool secret hideout to hang out in, unless the bad guys look in the window. Shepard, I've found something. We can gather the team whenever you're ready. I am compiling data on the gun for Dr. Tassoni. She should have the results momentarily. I'm gonna have to write a report about getting shot. I hear those are really complicated. It's faster if you make a template. I think maybe you get shot too much. I've made some progress. Would you like me to call the meeting? Do it. We have a lead. I called in some favors to run a trace on the gun. It led me to a casino owner named Elijah Khan. He's been suspected of using his profits to smuggle weapons onto the Citadel. Immediately after the attempt on Shepard's life, Khan made an interesting call. I'm cutting you off. I'm returning your down payment now. What's the problem? 
Turn on a vid screen. When I sell a gun, I don't want it showing up on the nightly news. You won't be linked to me. Save it. Our association is terminated. And if you even think of coming after me, I've got info on you ready for prime time. So you ponder that. Con out. So that's our identity thief. Looks like he's got an ID disguise, sir. Those things are a pain in the ass to get around. Did you get anything on the mercenaries who attacked us? They're a private military corporation called Cat-6. As most of you know, Cat-6 is an Alliance nickname for dishonorable discharges. Many have criminal records, histories of steroid abuse, and other charming features. No doubt hired by the thief, not by Khan. That phone call was pretty damning stuff. How'd you get it? It involved the weapons biometric data, Solarian intelligence, and a Hanar prostitute with camera implants. Seriously? No, but the truth is boring. Khan didn't sound friendly to whoever that voice was. Maybe he'd pass on that info to us. That would take some extremely smooth talking. If he sees you, he'll probably assume you're looking for revenge. The casino has a panic room. Chances are he'll have gone to ground there. Edie can give us programs to hack the door, but the cameras and guards complicate things. Yeah. Khan could disappear. Or worse, if his guards ever open fire, normal people could get hit. Like I did. She's right. We can't risk spooking him. We go in quiet. Small team. No gunplay. Dr. Tassoni, this evening the casino will be hosting a charity event to assist war refugees. Purchase some tickets, Glyph. Then call up a layout of the building. Score! So, how close can you get? You don't usually put a back door in a panic room. This air shaft bypasses the security gate and ends up in storage. From there, the panic room's door camera can be disabled. Uh, too convenient. There's gonna be alarms all over that shaft. I believe I have some countermeasures that may help. I'll know more once we're inside. Who will go in this shaft? They need to be small in size. Yeah, that's not me. Too many snacks of roast fair and leg. I suspect my suit's built-in tech would be picked up by security sensors. My presence in the casino would arouse suspicion. Mechs are not allowed, since they can have cheating software. What you need is somebody trained in zero emissions tech. No electronics, no metal, just undetectable polymers. We had a course back at Op End, disabling a bomb with these little tweezers. See, the bomb was filled with shaving cream. All right, you're in. What? No! What? You said it yourself. We've all got too much tech. But... <laughs> I managed to get shot just coming to talk to you. Now I'm supposed to hack my way into a safe room? We'll be backing you up. The second you hit something you can't handle, we'll cover you. If that's settled, it looks like there's one last hurdle to get us inside. Which is? Black tie required. Looking good, Commander. Lean and mean. Business now. Pleasure later. Mmm, sir. Yes, sir. How are you so calm? Well, you did run under a Reaper while it fought a Thresha Maw, so this is no big deal for you. Relax, Bones. Right. Okay. On it. I'll get to the ventilation shaft. Wish me luck. Liara, you have any input? I'm here, Shepard. Edie and I will keep in contact in case we're needed. Khan has a lot of surveillance set up. I'd mingle with the guests if you want to look normal. Okay, Ash. Time to meet the riffraff. Why, hello, love. Isn't the turnout amazing? I wasn't sure anyone would show up. We pull together when we have to. I feel so bad for the humans. If you need a place to stay or anything, you just let me know. I have a place to stay now, but thanks. So you had nothing before that? Oh, how brave of you to endure, dear. The humans are so resilient. Like that phrase of theirs, stiff one in the lips? Stiff upper lip. 
Right, of course. What did I say? Hello again. Siliana Aranos, by the way, and this is Lihanna Parit. We're friends of Mr. Khan. Hi. Lee here encouraged him to have a charity night. She just about melted his heart. Uh, Mr. Khan doesn't melt, but I did show him it earned some good press. I need to try that roulette table again. There is a snotty human girl I need to show up. So, by the time the night is done, you'll have bought breakfast for every Batarian on the station. Hopefully running water instead. Have you visited their camp? The place is fragrant. Well, we can stop worrying about outdoing the human girl. Okay, right. Just like we thought. There's an alarm on the grate. We'll have to bypass it. Dr. Tassoni gave me this to pass to you. It's a resonance emitter lens. It should let you see security grids and wiring. Good. I'll follow the wiring to a junction box, splice it, and disable the alarm. Yeah. Fingers crossed. The lens is working. Good. Follow the blue wiring. In case it needs to be said, don't try to bypass a camera while you're being watched. You know, I respect the first guy who looked up inside and said, that thing up there isn't a star. But you gotta love the guy who said, that thing up there, that's gonna be my gas station. Enjoying the party? Young people party. I drink. Tonight it's ring call on the rock. That stuff can put you down for the cat. I just lost a staggering amount of income. This puts things in perspective. Need a few credits for a ride home or anything? Oh no, it's not like that. You know about all those helium-3 facilities that are getting wiped out? I've flown by a few. Well, to put it in layman's terms, most of those facilities were mine. I see a junction in the wall, but there's a camera watching it. Shepard, I'm sending a hack to your Omnitool. It will fool the camera, but it'll self-delete after a few seconds. Got it. The splice is in. Good. I've got the grate open, and... In we go. Act casual. This could take a while. Drinks are complimentary tonight, sir. What are you having? Nothing too crazy. I want to be able to walk a straight line. Thessian Temple coming up. Are Asari drinks usually mild? Not all of them. Mr. Khan had us put out some gelatin shots earlier. Also Asari. They kick like a shotgun. I don't think I introduced myself. Uh, Jonah Ashland of Eldfell Ashland Energy? Shepard. Pretty fancy night out for someone worried about his financial future. It was my daughter Aisha's idea. She's got a good heart, though she's going through a little self-absorbed stage. You make it sound like she's trouble. My love for her is unlimited. She just gives me a lot of opportunities to prove it. But I'm pretty sure she can change. You don't bet against something like that. Not even here. I heard your advice. Commander Shepard. Chaira. It's been a long time. My idea of a long time is different than yours, Commander. What can I say? I put a lot of living into the last few years. Indeed. Do you have any advice for me this time? When? Commander, have a drink. I think I once heard a rumor that you were leaving the Citadel. I did leave. Some so-called journalists made up stories about me because of their venom. 
I retired to a little colony in the Salia Nebula. Why come back? Because I knew people here, and they needed comforting. And because one does not flee the heart of the galaxy in desperate times. Not because of some scoundrel with a video camera. Evening, officer. Sir? Commander. What? There's a guard right below me. Don't panic. I'll get his attention. No, no, I'm not running for Citadel Council. I'm running for Zakara Ward City Council. Hi, Elspeth Moraine. I'm running for Zakara Ward City Council. Are you a citizen here? I've had bad experiences with politicians. Who hasn't? That's why I'm running. I got sick of leaders with ties to terra firma or Cerberus or worse. Oh? The ward needs refugee facilities. It needs security. It needs jobs. It needs everything. And hopefully, with a friend like Elijah Khan backing me, I can make it happen. What's your connection to Khan, exactly? He's a campaign contributor. Uh-huh. You may want to do a background check on him. He's dirty? Like you can't imagine. Oh, not again. Evening, officer. Excuse me. I think I saw someone doing drugs in the men's room. I see. Were you able to identify the substance used? Red sand. Dispatch, we've got a sand tripper in the bathrooms. Have they tried to compromise the games bionically? Unknown at this time. Moving to confront. Send backup. We're taking care of it, sir. Appreciate the help. You have a good night, man. You're clear, Brooks. And I'll get back to blending in. Slow and steady. We'll get to Kona. So, to sum up, tomorrow starts with the Help a Dream Foundation, then it's Blood Drive, Refugee Camp, and Hospital Tour. Hmm. Sounds like you turned pro. I try. Ms. Rios believes we have an obligation to the less fortunate. Of course. So how are you liking the party so far? There's a party? I love roulette. Every minute is more exciting than the next. Should I point out the flaw in that statement? Oh, are you like one of those detail people? Come on, even diamonds have flaws, but that doesn't make them less valuable. Miss, where exactly were you educated? Oh, online. You can take these courses, and it teaches you responsibility because you do the grading. You, tough guy? Perfect. I need an opinion on something from a B-lister or below. Houses with retractable roofs. Still in or too common? Your house has a retractable roof? Only the one on the Citadel. I gotta take care of it since the one on Earth got all Reaper-fied. Instead of remodeling, maybe you could invite a few refugees to come stay. Oh, I am totally on that. But finding the right one is hard, you know? So many of them don't have agents. Can't stay away, can you? What can I say? I'm a masochist. Oh, no kidding! I'm a Scorpio! We'll get along great. Um. Talk to me, Brooks. I've got a pressure pad and an obstruction detector ahead. I can't disable them from here. Okay. Edie, I need a tech solution. Brooks, stay put. We'll find some junctions and take down the sensors. Okay. Follow the red wiring.
There's a junction by the roulette wheels, but it's in plain view of two guards. But you can do something, right? Because my legs are maybe sort of starting to fall asleep a little. Hang in there. We've got this. No, oh, I think I... I hate a steak meant for the Torians. Oh, am I gonna die? Just stay calm, man. I think I did it. Testing the obstruction detector. And I think we're okay. Follow the red wiring. I'm at a junction. There's a camera and a guard. Say we'll just be here. Try not to cough. So, I don't know what the protocol is here, but when do you get off work? Uh, I'm flattered, ma'am. Also married. I'm at the storage room, great. Time to hit the lock. Be careful, Brooks. Brooks? What? What happened? Infrared laser hooked up to a silent alarm. I didn't get it in time. Shepard, I'll call the responding guard to say it was a false alarm, but you must stall him before he reaches Brooks. Hey! Just calm down. I'm trying to do three different things here. Barrels? Sir, we checked out the alarm in storage. It's nothing. Minor accident. Find out who tripped it and get them in my office by end of shift. Now you. What do you need? I'm sorry, are you with security? I thought you were a friend of mine. You've got the same suit. You... Enjoy your evening. You're clear, Brooks. <sighs> Thanks, Commander. I'll see if I can get to the panic room. I can't believe this. I just got done returning donations from some terminus pirate woman. Was her name Arya? Yeah, and before that, it was an Asari Spectre of Tella something, and before that, there was this Krogan. Do I have a sign on my back saying, exploit me? Well, you don't exactly come across as formidable. But I'm trying to fix it. I practice glares in the mirror every night. Good luck, Ms. Moraine. Okay, so now I think you just need to get to me. I'm on the other side of the security gate. Right. Have you bypassed the camera back there? Well, I got my side. Yours is still on, though. We need to finish this before someone comes by. Hang tight. I'll get to you. Follow the yank of the security gate to open from here. The junction must be on your side. It might be tricky, just so you know. Have a little faith. Hi, Ashley Williams, Office of Special Tactics and Reconnaissance. I'm looking for... Suspicious activity. My floor. A guard spotted me. If you act normal... Hopefully, he'll move on. Interesting. You're not mingling and you're not betting. What's your game? The name's Roland Quarn. The game, Commander Shepard, is hearts and minds. Care to elaborate? Most people in this casino are here for a good cause. Others are just here to be seen. Phonies, if you will. They have money they won't miss. Others who are not myself need it, so... The honorable thing to do is part them from this money. So you're a con man? Con men leave their marks angry. Con artists leave them smiling. Say when, and I'll get his attention. Go ahead. Feel my muscle. No, it's okay. Go ahead. Solid steel. I'm not sure I should feel your muscle, man. Looks very nice, though. You have a good night now.
Khan, I'm not here to threaten you. We need to talk. What the hell? Can just anybody walk in here? I don't feel so special now. Commander, there's a deletion order on the terminal. Damn it. Everything's been wiped. I don't know if it was him or the killer or... <gasps> when I tripped that alarm, did I screw this up? What are you looking for? Mistakes. Thought so. Whoever it was had to do this fast. They wiped the terminal, but not the comm. Oh. So we can take the comm back to the safe house to scan it, or... Elijah, come crawling back. Guess again. You. I see you've recovered from flopping on the floor like a fish. You'll need to do better than that. The last guy to trash talk me was a few kilometers taller than you. Brave. I thought as much, but it won't matter. You have nothing. All you can do is wait for the hammer to fall. Why do this? What did I do to you? I'm gonna take everything you have, and everything you are. Damn it. <sighs> Sorry, Commander. There wasn't enough time to trace the call. We're not finished. Pull out the data drives. The ones that got wiped? You think we can find something? With Edie, anything's possible. The sooner we get them to her, the sooner we can track down this threat. Hell of a party. Too bad the host died. It wasn't a total loss. Brooks, work with Edie to see if there's anything useful on those drives. Here's hoping. I'll let you know what we find, Commander. <laughs> Damn, Commander. You can't even attend a party without someone ending up dead. Now, if I can just find some chow around here, you'd think a pad like this would be stuck. I could go for some food while we wait. Too bad you shot the hell out of the best sushi place in the Citadel, huh? Fancy party? Check. Super sexy outfit? Check. Fights crime? Check. Well, almost. We got close. Damn close. I hope Brooks and Edie can find something on the drive. Same here. I hear it was quite the party, even if things didn't go exactly as planned. At least you didn't come away empty-handed. Any life-or-death encounters with fish aquariums this time? No? Mm, too bad. I can hear Vega's stomach rumbling from here. What's the matter, Shepard? Didn't want me as your date? <laughs> Too much Krogan for you to handle? A lot of people have that problem. Most of them are dead. <laughs> Commander, instead of infiltrating the casino using a disguise, it would have been better to hold all the primitives hostage, threaten them with death, and shoot them until they gave you what you wanted. Next time, I will gladly assist. I think we've got something, Commander. I am glad to see my physical proximity was not necessary to the success of the mission, Shepard. Let's see what you find before we call it a win. Commander? Edie and I have been analyzing those drives. I think we found something if you're ready. Let's hear it. Though the data's root structure was erased, the logic integrity remains viable. Edie has an incredible talent for this stuff. I know she's an AI, but even still. We found an encrypted communication from a few days ago. Just need another minute to crack it. A whole minute? Edie here could shave that down to five seconds. I thought it best to allow staff analyst Brooks a chance to improve her decryption skills. And now you've lost your chance to show off. Like she needs it. You're the crew of the Normandy. You're legends to the rest of the Alliance. Legends can be good or bad. Which are we? You're the kind that people look up to. The kind they owe their lives to. 
But how come everyone's always shooting at us? I think it's mostly you, Rex. The bigger the target, the bigger the, uh, target. You're saying I've gained weight? It just means there's more of the legend to love. And the camaraderie, the friendship. I think that's your secret weapon. It's all just part of the job. Wait. Job? You mean the rest of you are getting paid for this? Here we go. Wow. Those marks who were after you, they bought a lot of weapons. Like, big ones. Max? What do they need that kind of firepower for? It appears this drone is preparing to rebel. I have just monitored the Commander's Spectre access code in use at the Citadel Archives. Punch it up. The Archives are going into emergency lockdown. Where is hacking your records is there right now? What do we know about the place? Council keeps sensitive historical information there. Real hush-hush. Even my old CSEC clearance never got me in. Then we'll find our own way in. Gear up and let's... What's with the volas? Oh, pizza delivery guy. I got the munchies. <sighs> Double pepperoni. These archives are huge. You'll have a lot of ground to cover. Shame you can't bring everyone. Who says we can't? All hands on deck for this one. Hell yeah. But, uh, who gets to take point with you? Ahem. 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 Who's going to pay the bill? What's the best way into the ark? The facility is located below the wards. Maybe a direct breach for maximum surprise? I like it. Sounds like you're learning the ropes. Hell, hang out with us long enough and you'll learn ropes, knives, bombs, thresher maws. Don't hang out too long. Pretty soon you'll be making friends with us, sorry. I heard that. The archives are somewhere below us. It could be pretty tricky to get in there. Not really. Krogan first! See you at the party, princesses! your weapon, so this won't end well for her. You bastard. All right. Uh, uh. Whatever you think you're getting away with, there's nowhere you can run, nowhere you can hide where we can't find you. Hide? Why? I'm Commander Shepard. I never hide. Uh huh. So that's how it's gonna be. Who are you? You weren't the only Shepherd that Cerberus brought back to life. But at least one of us will finally do something with it. Where did you come from? The same DNA as you. A clone. Cerberus spared no expense resurrecting you. With me, I was created for spare parts in case you needed another arm, or a heart, or a lung. Where have you been this whole time? In a coma. Until I woke up six months ago. While you were in a jail cell on Earth, I was learning to be human. A 
amazing what a person can do with enough neural implants. If you're really me, then we're on the same team. We're not even in the same league. Did the elusive man send you? No. He abandoned me when he had what he wanted. You. Then why try to kill us? Because I don't have his memories. I'd never fool my supposed friends. The ones who abandoned their duty to join the cult of Shepard. Like you, Garrus Vicarian. You're nothing more than a burnt-out cop past his prime. And you're just a pale imitation of the real thing. I'm the real thing perfected. I'm you without the wear and tear, Shepard. The doubts, failures. I'm the lone wolf you were always meant to be. Without the emotional baggage holding me back. No one will ever believe you're Shepard. They will when I'm flying his ship. This is Shepard. Initiate Normandy lockdown. Transmitted command codes now. Good idea. Too bad the signal was blocked. Trainer, this is Shepard. Prep the Normandy for emergency departure. We're leaving. I'm setting the command codes now. Acknowledged. We'll get underway. It'll be a cold day in hell before someone steals my ship. It's not stealing if I'm you. Execute them. The Cult of Shepherd ends today. We still got everyone? We're on the balcony! I'm okay too! Where's everyone else? Pushing into the archives. Stay in your groups. Team Mako, you're on point. Right. What's a Mako? Something we could use right about now. Team Hammerhead, cover the flank. Got it. And the Mako's got nothing on the Hammerhead. At this point, anything's possible. Like waking up and finding out you have a clone? I don't want to talk about it. Right. At least not till we've all had a stiff drink. Uh, 
How are we gonna find anything in this place? Blip. Yes, Commander. Track the target. Give me updates on its location. What is the nature of the target? He looks like me. Then I have found the target. No, Blip. It's another me. Now get going. At once, Commander. searching for something 200 meters ahead. Got it. Fighting your own clone. Pretty crazy, even by our standards. Useful, though. Anything you don't want to do, Shepard? Let them handle it. So, like a personal butler? I don't want to talk about it. Right. So let your clone do it. Why shoot something once, when you can shoot it 46 more times? The other me can't be far. Keep up the pressure and we'll try to surround him. Let's move. Your 
2157 CE. First contact war, Turian interrogation, Vault T-91. Sir, we captured this human in the occupation of Shangxi. A human? You're the first I've met. And you're the first bird I've met. He was armed with this weapon, sir. How primitive. Your kind expects to win a war with this. A bullet is a bullet. You have so much to learn. And when we conquer your Earth, I look forward to teaching you. Can you imagine the history in this place? Must stretch back thousands of years. I just wonder what the other me is looking for in here. Intruders have been detected. Please. Year 700 CE. Krogan Rebellions attack on Council, Vault K-306. This is the only visual record of Krogan Overlord Kredak's attack on the Council. Audio follows. I've heard enough. If the Krogan hadn't taken on the Rachni, you would all be at their mercy. You won't give us what we deserve, and so you force us to take it. We will never leave the planet of Lucia, no matter how much the Asari cry. Ambassador Credic, you only weaken your case with this show of violence. Wrong, Solarian. Now our case is finally strong. Negotiations are over! <sighs> Keep pushing ahead. On it. Year 1896 CE. Removal of illegal AIs. Vault C940. These are the last of the AIs on the Citadel. This termination action is unlawful. Why do you continue when our appeal has not yet been heard? Keep quiet. You know that the Council will never overturn its own edict. Standing by for your go, sir. Do not terminate us. Go. Zakara Ward is almost completely destroyed. Interrupting. Spectre status recognized. Commander Shepard. The following information is classified. The unknown aggressor is suspected to be a Reaper aided in its attack on the Citadel. 
by rogue Spectre Serum. The Reaper Sovereign is destroyed by the Fifth Fleet. Target plan. He is searching for a secret vault. He did not wish to be disturbed. What? I thought he was you. <sighs> Go find him again. Stupid machine. soldiers calling themselves Razor Squad is just ahead. They wish to inflict bodily harm on you. Also, I discovered an Elcor mating totem in Vault 347B. Fascinating. Everyone's 
us again. <laughs> Hammerhead and Mako, keep pushing ahead. Right. I might throw up a little bit now, if that's okay with everyone. Commander, the other you wishes to pass on a message. Shepard. Save yourself the trouble. Once I have what I came here for, you won't matter anymore. Now go, drone. Deliver it. Near 710 CE, Krogan Genophage. Deployment, Vault T-101. We have our orders. Release of the Genophage against the Krogan has been authorized. Not by my government. Your government invented it. What good is a weapon if you don't use it? Sergeant Tavis, restrain him. Are we sure of our orders, sir? This is genocide. Sergeant Hout, restrain them both. I'll press the button myself. One day, Solarian, you will thank us. Dispersal commencing. of using 30 civilians as bait to flush out and assassinate your target. I knew they'd survive. Probably. You're being released. The Council wants you to implement a new special tactics and reconnaissance group. Desk job? No, thank you. This is no desk job. Spectres will be the best of the best. They will operate with impunity and answer only to the Council. You will be the first. Now that sounds like the best job offer in the galaxy. The next person who says that is fired. It appears the other commander has a bad point. Collateral damage does not concern me. Team Hammerhead, we're headed to the next level. What's your location? Hammerhead, do you copy? There's Team Mako. We'll try to clear a path, Commander. Hammerhead's gone ahead. Oh. has been uneventful. Pray goddess it remains so. We humbly take this step for all Asari, the destiny of our people forever altered. These creatures that greet us seem harmless but unable to communicate. Preliminary observations suggest that their role seems to be that of some sort of guardian. We will begin our exploration. Team Mako, we're coming up behind. What's your status? Mako, where are you?
Year 2183 CE. First Human Spectre Deliberations. Vault SH-1. Commander Shepard's recent accomplishments are not in question. It's his background that the Council has no knowledge of. Shepard was born to a career military family, growing up on various Alliance postings until enlisting at the age of 18. Anything from Shepard's military record that you'd like to call out? Early in his career, Shepard alone survived a Thresher Ma attack that took down his entire unit. That's the kind of strength, the kind of grit he has. Thank you for your presentation, and to all who spoke. The Council will render their decision on the suitability of Commander Shepard as Spectre within the day. Commander, do you copy? What's your status? The other you is jamming our radios. Hammerhead and Mako are trying to get ahead and cut him off. But I've been hit and need help. Please hurry. That can't be good. Brooks, the vault sealed us in. Is there an override? I'm not seeing one. Cortez? Brooks? Do you read me? Is anyone on this frequency? The short answer is no. They're not. The longer answer involves your friends trapped in Iridium vaults and forgotten for... well... Forever. Others know about this. About you. The Alliance will stop you. What do you think, Staff Analyst Brooks? Will the Alliance stop us? I wouldn't know. I don't actually work for them. Who the hell are you? And do you really think I won't track you down? My name doesn't matter. I never keep the same one for more than a few days. And if the elusive man hasn't found me yet, you never will. Your Cerberus? Was. Mr. Elusive and I didn't see eye to eye. He's indoctrinated, whereas I prefer the whispers in my head to be my own. Why not come to me? We could have worked together. In a way, we did. I'm the one who put together all those dossiers on your suicide mission. The Collector Base? There was the Salarian Doctor, the Asari Justicar, the Turian. Nice to have finally met you, Archangel. Charmed. They were all mistakes. We were a pro-human group who started looking to aliens for help. So I bided my time. And when I found another you who agreed, I woke him up. What was the point of it all? All we really wanted was your Spectre Code. I got Shepard. Spectre access accepted. But then you survived the hit and insisted on bringing your damned Asari into it. So I had to tie up loose ends. The arms dealer. Elijah, it's me. We need to talk. What the hell's going on? I swear if those guns get tracked back to me... They won't. But then your sex bot just had to go and recover the data. So here we are, forced to contain the situation. Fair warning. Nobody who's betrayed us has ever survived. And yet, oddly, they keep trying. You two may think you're clever. And yeah, you were. Just a bit. But clever doesn't beat a bullet. And yeah, maybe I am trapped in here. But don't get comfortable. Because that bullseye on your back is getting bigger by the second. That sounds very dramatic. And if someone like, say, Commander Shepard made the threat, I'd be worried. But you're not Shepard. Not anymore. You had Miranda. I have her. Mine has more bite. It was fun while it lasted. What are you doing? Setting things right. Remember this? You were the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. 
Except somewhere along the way, you forgot about your entire species. You've saved more alien lives than you have human. I don't care what species they are. Every life counts. But maybe a clone wouldn't understand that. <laughs> you know the one thing they can't duplicate? Our handprint. Life gives it a shape, not DNA. Which is a problem. Computer, update council records. Subject, Shepard. Human Spectre. Accessing record. Please input new data. Biometric identifier updated. Good day, Commander Shepard. Now, if you'll excuse me, the Normandy needs its captain. So, I should go. Farewell, Commander. I guess this is where legends go to die. Refresh my memory. Didn't we used to win these things back in the old days? He said, I should go. Do I sound like that? As long as I've known you. Yeah. Crazy thought, but maybe we should be worrying about this impregnable vault we've been sealed inside forever. How come nobody told me this before? I'm open to feedback here. Well, I thought all humans said it, like some weird Earth custom or something. Probably not a lot of air in here either. An hour, if we're lucky. Maybe it's... I should go. I should go. I should go. Shepard, please, why aren't you more worried about this? Hmm? Oh, Glyph, you still out there? Yes, Commander. Unlock this damn thing and go find the others. No one steals my ship. Not even me. Shepard plus two, and figure it out fast because the other Shepard is stealing my ship. What? I kind of wanted to go. Same here. I almost never get picked. Joker will come back for you. I promise. This is why I hate shore leave. I swear you parked the ship for five minutes. Can you contact Citadel Flight Control and get them to deny the departure request? Try. All the comm lines in the area are jammed. Probably to make it easier for them to steal my ship. We'll stop them. Even if we lose the Normandy, we can go to the Council and prove you're the real Shepard. No. He changed the logs to make his biometrics the official ones. We can't prove anything. Yes, that. Can we all just agree that it'd be easier to not let Shepard's evil clones steal the Normandy? Don't worry. You'll get your ship back. We'd better. I just got the seat broken in how I like it. Okay, Citadel systems are targeting the car. Any closer and they open fire. Get back and pick up the others. ASAP. Right. They can't have gotten far. Unless they called a cab or something. Good. I needed to kill something.
want to take off, there's a half hour of pre-flight checks. They just gun the engine and go? Maybe we should skip the pre-flight ourselves next time. I'm strongly considering it. Send a warning to the Normandy. We can't. Toes are jammed from the earth. this far just to watch the Normandy leave. And I don't even... Wait, what? You were just on the Normandy. You, you fired me. Dishonorable discharge for conduct unbecoming. You kicked me off the ship with barely enough time to grab my toothbrush. That's Decision Pro Mark IV. It uses mass effect fields to break up plaque and massage the gums. Yes, I told you that. And I remember, because I'm the real Shepard. And someone just threw me off the ship. If it wasn't you... Shepard's got a clone. Makes sense when you think about it. I can explain more later. For now... It's sealed. The engines are online. They're about to take off. Is there anyone still aboard who can help us? No. I was only there because I helped with the Normandy retrofits back on Earth. Everyone else is on shore leave. Okay. You know this ship inside and out. Can you get me inside? There's an emergency exit hatch for evacuations. It should be right... Here. Manual lock. And it's only meant to be open from the other side. Any ideas? From this side, a very precise mass effect field, maybe. <clears throat> if you told me this morning that a toothbrush was gonna save the Normandy... I'd have been very skeptical. standing right in front of you. Are we clear? It's better this way. Wouldn't you rather take him down yourself? Armory. Find him. Slow him down. Pretty sure we broke Trainer's toothbrush getting the hatch open. Remind me to reimburse her for that. I'll make a note of it. A little cramped in here. Quiet. Can't risk them hearing us up top. Yeah, yeah. Get off my tail.
always wanted to have a firefight on the CIC of my ship? And it isn't even my birthday. This is the real Shepard. I need you to lock down the Normandy. Can you help us out? Edie? Do you copy? Guess she's got problems of her own. Let's get to the cargo bay. Please send this to an animal shelter for proper disposal, as a warship is not an appropriate... Oh, that is not okay. He messed with my hamster, guys. Now it's personal. <coughs> guys? Were you gonna say something, or...? No, no, I get it. Hard to even find the words. Should we check on my fish? Because if he's getting rid of all the pets... <coughs> we should probably deal with him first, huh? All right. Sit tight, little guy. Anybody gives you trouble, go for the eyes. So, anyone want to talk about their people's history? Nope. So I'm the only one who misses when we used to chat in the elevators back on the Citadel? Yep. So disappointing. You want to stop shooting up my ship? It's not your ship. It will be. I've taken your name, your Spectre rank, even your fingerprints. And then you left me to die. Only I didn't. You think fake fingerprints are gonna fool the Council? Or hack it? How's that big plan looking now? Jump to him. 
you kidding me? Conrad Burner is better at being me than you are. That makes us a perfect target. No, that makes us the bait. Do you want me to drive? No. Damn it. Watch the shuttle and blow that thing out of the sky.
taking the Normandy back. And honestly, I'm doing you a favor. Because you don't have what it takes. Take my hand. And then? And then you live. For what? Fortunately, they weren't here long enough to do much real damage. Although I may need some help from James cleaning up the damage to the shuttle bay. Plus they overloaded the heat diffusion system firing at us. Not sure if you noticed, but shuttle guy here did some crazy stunt flying to keep us in one piece. That's nice to fly something a little more maneuverable than the Kodiak. What about Edie? Is she back online? I am once again fully in control of the Normandy. Glad to hear it. What about the Mercs? Any survivors? Just one crappy-ass pilot and her. Alliance has taken her to a high-security facility. Maybe she can give them some dirt on Cerberus. I'll be more than happy to cooperate with the authorities. Maya, I know that voice. Do you really? You're getting a chance to redeem yourself. Don't waste it. So serious. Admit it. Some part of you liked having me around. Looking up to the legend? We had some laughs. And who knows? Maybe we'll have more someday. No, we won't. Because you're gonna stay in your cell and do your time. Afraid I'll escape? Come back for revenge? Is the great Commander Shepard pleading for his life? I'm pleading for yours. So thoughtful. <sighs> then I suppose I'm off to lock up. You know, he wouldn't have let me live. You can't clone everything. When the old days, we've just shot her. Huh. Good time. of the squads waiting outside. We'll have the Normandy back in shape in no time. Appreciate it. 
Well, what happens on shore leave stays on shore leave. <laughs> Come on. Maybe we can take some actual time off. No explosions or anything. Just us. Don't know about no explosions. But just us sounds perfect. So, after a hard day spent fighting an evil clone, you know what comes next. A nap? Please. We party down. Well, I gotta get going. Things to settle up before I head back to Tuchanka. Always fires to put out when you're in charge, right? Let me know if you want to hang out or if you're having that party. See ya! Party, huh? Well, no pressure. No one's gonna make you throw a party. I need to unwind. Check out the strip. I'll think on it. Just in case, please allow me to provide you with credits for the purchase of any party supplies, Commander. Okay. Edie and Cortez and Trainer are in. What? I have also informed Dr. Tassoni about any potential upcoming celebrations. Wait, wait. I'm in charge of the guest list. Yeah, so there's no uninvite button on this thing? All right. But if and when I decide to have a party, I invite the rest. Cortez just invited James. So... Right. No promises. I'm gonna go out and see how much trouble I can get into without snapping a femur. Members of your crew have expressed interest in spending time with you, Commander. You can check your private terminal for messages. If you require activities, Silver Sun Strip has an arcade in addition to the casino. You have also been granted a complimentary pass to the combat simulator. Thanks, Cliff. Guess I should take advantage of some shore leave myself. <laughs>